How bad is the Fed worried about the economy? Even though nobody knows the future of the financial market, there are ways of gathering data and performing analysis. One of these ways is by observing key financial, governmental institutions. At the moment, available indicators point to the fact that the Federal Reserve System is worried about the economy. In this video, we discuss the extent to which this is true and how worried investors should be. One of the most basic properties that is inherent to all financial markets is unpredictability. Consider the stock market, the real estate market, and even the cryptocurrency market. If these markets were readable and predictable, then they wouldn't be fair. After all, some people could just gang the systems to make themselves rich, and then the whole thing would be a sham. But in as much as these markets are unpredictable, this doesn't mean they are immune to analysis. As a matter of fact, the highest level investors in the world spend millions of dollars to analyze the market and predict markets. In fact, there are entire companies that are dedicated to this nature of analysis. These companies do manage to come up with interesting results from time to time. However, every now and then, certain unpredictable market events happen upsetting the balance of everything. But in any case, these forms of analyses are better than nothing at all. Although many of these forms of analysis are computational, some of them are observational. Traders try to observe their closest competitors in order to find out what they know and what their behaviors reveal that they know. Unfortunately, this route doesn't always provide the best results. And this is further complicated by the fact that some transactions take place in secret or are handled by holding companies. However, there are other ways for stakeholders to read the economy by observation. This comes in the form of observing banks, financial institutions, and other companies. Suppose it's a bank an investor saves in or invests in. In that case, they may be privy to some insider knowledge on performance and projections. However, suppose the financial institution in question is a public financial institution. In that case, all such information it has should be publicly available. The Federal Reserve System, or the Fed, is the central bank of the United States of America. It is broken down into 12 major banks which oversee different geographical locations of the country. The Fed has a variety of functions. Let's touch on them briefly, one by one. For one, the Fed is responsible for reducing risk within financial markets. Although some degree of risk is inherent to all markets, Risk has often been used to exploit others. And so, by minimizing risk, the Fed protects people from themselves. Again, the Fed is the means by which the government implements monetary policies. These policies either line up with the government's vision or come about in order to restore balance to the financial world. Another one of the Fed's responsibilities is to provide financial service to the government. There's so much that goes into this function. For one, the Fed may mobilize funds that the government needs to get its tasks done. It may also mediate financial deals between the government and international third parties or other governments. The Fed is also responsible for supervising banks and other financial institutions. You can think about it as the bank for banks. These other financial institutions collectively handle billions of dollars in private and public assets. The Fed makes sure these institutions do not mismanage the funds or screw their customers over. And lastly, and most importantly, the Fed is responsible for controlling inflation. After all, any government that allows inflation to run riot is in big trouble. We'll touch more on this shortly in the future. But from all these points, it should be clear to you why the Fed is such an important resource for traders. Given its importance within the structure of government and nation-building, the Fed is such an important and unique resource, and given that the Fed is funded by taxpayer money, most of its information must be shared with the public. There are things that the Fed knows due to its unique standing that would take days for the best-funded analytical companies to latch on to. As such, any investor who is worth their salt knows how important it is to pay attention to the information the Fed puts out. And so, this brings us to the original thesis of our video. How bad is the Fed worried about the economy? Well, recent information released from the Fed indicates that there's a unique threat to the economy, which they are currently worried about. And this threat is inflation. Inflation is an economic situation in which a currency loses its purchasing power. 
This could be in general or in relation to another currency. Inflation could lead to economic disaster if led to run on unchecked. It could destroy the standard of living of citizens in a country, as well as make the government incapable of purchasing goods and services from overseas. Inflation should be a particular concern to all traders. After all, it implies that for the same level of risk and hard work, your monetary reward is now worth less. There are ways by which investors could protect themselves from inflation. For instance, buying stronger currencies such as pounds, euros, yuan, or yen. Investors don't have to solely rely on their own cunning to combat the effects of inflation, though. The government also has certain strategies and techniques it can put into place to slow inflation down. The entire idea is to drain public circulation of funds while increasing available funds for banks and other financial institutions. There's also the overall goal of decreasing spending so as to increase purchasing power. Inflation is not a new threat and is something that federal financial institutions have to contend with again and again. As such, the Fed is sure to handle this case of inflation well enough. However, it never hurts to take precautionary measures. Also, it pays to keep your ear on the ground for news of more developments. Coming to the end of this video, we hope you have learned the extent to which the Fed is worried about the economy. Smart investors can read into these signs in order to inform their own financial decision. To learn more, check out other videos on this channel. Our videos are always interesting and engaging, and you wouldn't want to miss out. Until next time, have a good day. Catch you later.